The new kids on the block still have the right stuff, and I have to admit, I still have a really big crush on those guys, and I could never interview them, well, properly anyway. See, the kids plan to take a tour break in 2010, but they just can't keep away from their friends north of the border. We just couldn't resist Canada. The new kids on the block have something up their sleeves for their Canadian fans. Shh, um, can't tell them what it is. No, I'm working it's all on pretty much everything. Go, go. Don't tell them. <laughs> Sorry, guys, the secret is out. The new kids will be performing in Ontario casinos this June so they can get up close and personal with their fans. We're going to have this concert that's going to be more of a party atmosphere, much different than anything we've done yet. I think we've all matured into good good guys, and when we get together, we kind of same. Also coming up is the annual New Kids on the Block cruise. The guys admit that most of the fans are female. We were just surrounded by this amazing female energy, and uh, it's, it's a lot of fun. And we go out and we, like, you know, bang on people's doors and, and just mix it up a lot with the, with the fans and just make it a really good time and a really fun time for, for us and them. Next week... From heartbreak, this is not the way I wanted it to end, to true love. Couldn't wait to tell him that I love him. The date is set, and we're going to find out all the details. Will there be an on-screen ceremony? Jillian Harris in our studio. That's next week. Now let's test your EQ. Which of the new kids on the block have Canadian parents born in Ontario? The answer is next. All right, before the break, we tested your EQ. Which of the new kids on the block have Canadian parents born in Ontario? The answer, Jonathan and Jordan Knight.